So you have your fabric in your frame, and then you have your needle and thread. So what you're going to do is find a spot in the middle, and then you're going to poke a hole in it from the back. So let's say poke a hole right here. But you have to make sure that it goes through one of the already made holes and that you don't poke a new hole. So it's going through, and you're going to pull it through. Just make sure that you don't pull it all the way through, or else the thread is going to go off the frame. And then you're going to poke it, poke the next hole in the top right. So you would put it right there and make sure you're still holding on to the back. You don't want to let that go. So you pull that through and then you're going to poke a hole at the bottom. So right there. And in the back, you need to make sure that your thread goes through the hole. This may be complicated for beginners because it's actually pretty hard. It was pretty hard for me when I first did it, but you get used to it. And then once it's in the hole, you're going to take your needle and pull. So now it's secured in the fabric so you can start um, stitching again. So now you're going to go into the next hole at the top right. And right now we're making half stitches, so you're basically making half X's. So it's going to go through. And then you're going to poke a hole at the bottom. And then you're going to go to the top right. So right now, that is three half stitches. Now, in order to make a full stitch, what you need to do is cross those X's. So you're going to go to the bottom. And you're always going to go back front, back front. And then to the top left. And you always have to make sure to hold on to the eye while you're doing this because if you don't, your thread is going to fall is going to fall out and it's going to make things really complicated because you'll have to put the thread back in to the needle. And then you're going to pull and then you're going to go to the bottom and then you're going to pull it out and put it on the top left. And there, that is three full stitches. So you can really go from three or any amount of half, sti half stitches to full stitches just by crossing them. Now, a quarter stitch, you're... Let, okay, so I'm going to poke a hole here, an already made hole. So I'm going to poke it there. And then I'm going to pull it out. And then I'm going to uh, poke a hole in the middle of these four pre-made pre -made holes. For, so for the quarter stitch, you actually have to poke a hole on your own. So it's going to go in the middle of those four holes, like so. And that's a quarter stitch. As you can see, it only covers one-fourth of the square, not one-half of it, or, f or it fully. And then you can make another quarter stitch just by going to the next hole and doing the same thing. And there you have it. Now, if this is the end, all you have to do is pull your needle out of the thread or pull the thread out of the needle and then... What you're going to do is just cut this, or cut your thread, and as you can see, it's now fully secured into your fabric, and there you go. That's the basics.